Sony Xperia X Z Premium for about a week now. Uh, and I must say I quite like it. Uh, actually, I wanted to make the video a half hour went about how slippery this thing is. Um, then I removed the protection thing I have from my XZ and compared them both and it's not, not so so bad, bad the thing as I thought. It's, it's slippery. Uh, it really likes to to move on flat surfaces. Uh, so uh, my first my first uh, comparison was this um, yeah, like like a super liquid fluid creeping up uh, a hill or like the, this moving stones where the wind moves the stones to the desert. This was quite my imagination of the device uh, because really. A few times it almost dropped, just that dropped from my hand and uh, same thing if you put it to charging on your counter desk or something and you only have to, to pull it a very little bit and it starts moving so um, but the, the thing is I usually always have protectors uh, I always use protection but this week I tried it without and yeah I highly would recommend to, to put something in because um, this improves the whole thing extremely yeah you can, you can see I can can go like 30 degrees with this without without a protector. I think we will not even manage. To, yeah, see it start moving at like yeah, five degree elevation. So yeah, three so uh, really. It's a slippery device. Um, I think mostly because of the gla gla uh, glass backside and. The fact that it does not have so many edges um, makes it really slip easily and you really, I think for this device it's mandatory to have anything, no matter if it's this kind, which I prefer, or like a flip case or something, um, everything would be fine, but without, you're really in danger that this thing drops and breaks quite fast. So, um, this was my, my major impression. Then. Uh, Sound is quite good, I have to say. So, but I don't use, I don't use, I use headphones all the time usually. So, it's not so big of a thing for me. Um, what else can we say? The um, yeah, screen is nice, but it's not so much difference to the to the X set. It's it's very shiny, as you said. Um, so in direct sunlight, it does not fare so well. It's not bad, but it's um, but it's also not fantastic. So with with high, with the high, the highest brightness, you can see it in direct sunlight. You can use it. It's just not not so much fun. So um, I think the one thing I said that would attract uh, thumbs quite easy. I think um, I tried. I did not clean it the whole week. So it has quite some thumbs on it, but it's a, a bit like like safe cleaning. So. Um, so really it does not hinder you so much so I haven't cleaned it at all the whole week and it didn't get any dirtier so at a certain point it's like like getting the you know you're wiping the the dirt off with your fingers there yeah. really interesting because uh, I would imagine that at some point it would be just thumbs and you would not see anything like with with um, when you use glasses you you I have the problem I have to wipe my glasses regularly because um, in the summer especially they get quite dirty quite fast and yeah this does not happen here so you can use it without cleaning uh i think i will still continue to go clean the screen just yeah you know from my from my uh an ecstasy or my my cleaning fetish i don't know um but uh this is better than i expected uh, annoying thing which i found which quite annoys me it's not a problem but um i found out that you Cannot transfer your apps to your um, to your memory card to your SD card. So um, yeah, was quite yeah. It's a software thing because on the, the it's the same Android version as on the XZ, and there you can transfer it without problems. But on this device, it does not work. And I actually I went and I checked out the Sony forums, which is quite nice integrated in the device. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's it's actually not possible on the device to move your apps to the memory card. So um, once the memory is full, you are stuck with it. With the 64 gigabytes of internal memory, it's not so much of an issue. It's just annoying me that they put it out. Um, many people uh, complained that double tap to wake up does not work anymore. 
uh, which I frankly I haven't even an idea what it is so I didn't probably didn't use it and didn't know it was there so it's not a point for me but uh, yeah some people complained about that in the forums uh, quite heavily I think this was about the major complaints of, of most people uh, that I saw so yeah I'm satisfied I'm quite satisfied um, but there are some issues and let's talk a bit about the 960 fps camera i already made two videos on this so you might check them out um, as i mentioned before uh, it only takes like 0.182 seconds of video in 960 fps so it's uh, really really difficult so i'll just show you how to activate this so you have like it's just it's nothing happening so it will not see it to activate and then you have to activate the slow motion but it now captures only it always only captures like 0 0.2 seconds uh, so a little bit above the reaction time and um this make this makes it quite difficult to to get anything into it so on the on screen because most things are faster uh, or already happened or they take longer than uh, 0.2 seconds so then you can only get a part of it maybe I can show you most of the times um, you end up getting only uh, getting slightly before slightly after what you wanted to film so that's quite a, the usual thing which happens this is another problem with the camera you get your um, I showed this here uh, you get a really extremely smaller screen compared to what you usually have so you can see this here so you see the effect the effect here yeah. this makes it you can see this this makes it extremely shaky here because like like you assumed in you zoomed in and yeah the the not slow motion part is super shaky and this may be the, maybe one of the reasons they let it at zero, uh, this about 0 0.2 seconds because um this is probably the time most people can hold this thing still so if you would have a longer slow motion video you would start to shake and this would be quite noticeable in the in the slow motion maybe one of the reasons they they did not venture and made, made it more usable so you can check out my other videos on this um it's a nice placing but nothing more at the moment so this is this is the, the thing i expected more but didn't get it um yeah so i continue to to collect my experiences and then i shared probably not probably will be a couple of weeks uh, i think there will not be, be so much be happening till next week so yeah let's see like we do a nine and a half weeks in sony xperia x set premium video then thank you very much for watching guys i hope my experience are worth a bit for you and yeah thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe to my channel check out my other totally unrelated stuff if you want to and yeah bye bye